Though often looked down upon or even illegal in traditional settings, the use of psychedelics like Ibogaine to treat addiction is not new and among proponents is regarded as one of the best ways to help someone overcome an addiction, especially to opiates. When we received an invite to visit an Ibogaine treatment center, we were excited to learn about this unique treatment alternative for ourselves. My name is Alvaro De Ferranti and I am the co-founder along with my wife Claire of Tabla Raza Retreat here in Portugal. Tabla Raza is fast becoming Europe's premier Ibogaine treatment center. What's different about what we do here is that we have a medically trained staff that is experienced with the administration of Ibogaine treatments. The treatments are further supported by holistic therapies. Ibogaine or Iboga, which is actually the name of the shrub from Gabon, is typically associated with the Bwiti tribe. Generally, it's a young man becoming a man and the whole village will get together and they will administer the Iboga, which is often in the form of root bark. So how does a rite of passage plant from Africa stop an addiction? Ibogaine is not a miracle cure. It is, however, an incredibly effective detox tool and an addiction interrupter. The beauty of Ibogaine is that it allows someone to resolve issues deep down. It has been said that Ibogaine is akin to receiving 10 years of psychotherapy in one night. It's particularly effective because you become your own psychotherapist. Ibogaine heals the pain by helping the user deal with deep-seated traumas, emotional baggage. With this understanding of how Ibogaine works as an addiction interrupter, Tabula Rasa recommends each client take part in a very thorough pre- and post-treatment counseling regimen to help them enact lasting change. We were able to meet one of their partner counselors who specializes in pre- and post-Ibogaine treatment counseling. Plants like iboga or any of these visionary plants that have been used by indigenous cultures around the world for hundreds or even thousands of years, people are educated their whole life on how you're supposed to use these. It's never a case of you just take it and then you transform or you heal. We, we help people learn to navigate that experience and take from that experience the things, the teachings that the, that the ibogaine can give them and put those into reality and, and make them a part of their life. And these are all things that actually require a lot of planning, a lot of work. Um, and Ibogaine can help you um, become empowered to do that. But if you don't do it yourself, then you're going to fall back into addiction. If you've done any research into Ibogaine, you will most likely come across the topic of safety. Alvaro addressed this issue head on. Let me be clear unassisted, unsupervised Ibogaine treatments can be very, very dangerous. However, if you administer Ibogaine in a safe setting with a professional medical team that has experience with the administration of Ibogaine, it's very, very safe. So at Tabula Raza, we're very, very strict with our protocols. We methodically evaluate the patient via their medical history, their psychiatric history, their physical attributes. On the day of an Ibogaine treatment, we take the patients to the local laboratory to take further blood tests so that we can ensure that they are safe to receive Ibogaine that day. And we have a whole medical team here who will run them through a lengthy process of medical questioning so that they are all very able to deal with a adverse event, especially a cardiac event. We have clients monitored 100% of the time. So with the important conditions discussed so far, that Ibogaine isn't a miracle cure and that treatment must be done in a medically supervised safe environment, Alvaro and his team believe Ibogaine can be an option for anyone looking for answers. This is not a theoretical belief but started with his own personal experience. Many years ago, I got into trouble with drugs and I had tried traditional rehab. I had tried hypnosis. I had tried to stop on my own. Many, many things were tried out and just nothing was working for me. 
I heard about Ibogaine through my wife and it just seemed that crazy and interesting enough that it was worth a try. And within a week of knowing about it, I was on a plane to Amsterdam taking Ibogaine. And I have to say it's been the most significant thing I have done in my recovery. Ibogaine is an amazing tool to help someone go through essentially a rite of passage and move on to the next level in terms of their own development so that they're able to take control of their life. 